Today we are here in Creve Core, Missouri at the Antique Mall of Creve Core. <laughs> so we're gonna go in here and see what we can find. Hopefully we find some really cool things, some vintage and antiques. That's to, what we like. Yeah, to resell. So <laughs> let's go inside. It's all Chinese food. Oh yeah. yeah, right over there. Look for red markdown tags. Mm -hmm. Yeah, boy, where's those red tags? Are there any tags that are red? So far, we went down a whole aisle and didn't get a thing, but that sometimes happens during the first aisle because I don't know why it does actually. It just does. There's some Anna Lee birds. Oh yeah, I know they're kind of creepy though. Their faces. Yeah. I mean, I can handle those little ones, but when you see the giant ones, I don't like them as much. I don't know. Yeah. Oh wow, creepy scarecrow. <laughs> you know what I like about this mall? The names of the areas. This is Lalique Lane. You know, Lalique Glass is a fancy kind of glass. There's Victorian Drive over there. There's an Art Deco something or other. Art Deco Ave. So maybe we'll find some Lalique <laughs> down this lane. That's cute. It is cute. So it's got a souvenir of Fredericktown, Missouri. And then it says Shawnee and it says, so in 1952, first camp trip. Jean Ella May. That is so cute that that says that. It is cute. So cute. It was like only $22. 22 yep. I, I think it might have a, I can't tell. Just the tip, berry tip. Yeah. It's not too bad. Do you want to get it? No, you don't. I don't. <laughs> Does Barb want to get it? So cute. I don't know. I think it's just a tiny bit. Yeah, it's a little bit for resale. For us to resell it. Look at all these little doodads. Lots of doodads. Doodads is one of my favorite words. It just is. No rhyme or reason. Oh boy, there's lots of things here. So there's lots of figurines, lots and lots. And I think we're a little bit backwards because we have to, we're going all the wrong ways. There's a cool chair over here. A what? A chair? I like chairs. Oh wow, that is pretty. Oh, you could ski with it. Did you? Let's see what it says. You just ski right down the slope. It says hand woven rocking chair, 230. My oh my. Ooh, and like, that's a nice furniture. Ooh, yeah, you are a <laughs> furniture that's nice. Hmm. Oh. Oh, Barb, do you remember when I had these? I sold them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This was one of my first like really cool things that I had. I, I forget what I paid for them. They were like, I want to say they were like $5 a chair or $20, $15 a chair. I don't think it was too much, yeah. And then I bought four of them at an auction and I sold them. But I don't remember how much they sold for. But it was like a couple hundred dollars for all four of them by the time I sold them. Mm -hmm. I was proud of myself. Mm -hmm. Sure was. Oh, yeah, so it's all furniture back here and prints on the walls. Yes. Prints. I didn't say prints. Let's do a bookshelf. Could you imagine if like prints was... The singer was like on the wall. <laughs> what are you looking at? Oh, just the Oh yeah. Got a cute little legs. Cute little legs. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I feel like we're really gonna be lost if we go out this door. Yeah, I'm very we should go back the way we came. Now this is a bent wood rocker. Actually this one's not really considered bent wood, but it's a it's a rocker and it has caning all over it. Now what goes bad the most is the caning itself. And people can repair this if if you, well, if you know how to. They also sell sheets of this online and you can have your fun with it, but it's sort of like the throw, the, not the throw, the throne, throw it, throne, why can't you throw it? The throne bent wood rockers. Throne would make more sense because it's like a throne where you sit. <laughs> oh, is it thrown? It's thone. It it's is thone. I'm pretty thone. sure, but, but it would have been fun. T H T H O N E T. Yeah. Look at all the mem and ms. Hmm. Mem and ms. I thought I saw Reese's cups over here too. I've never seen this kind of a vending machine. You're mocking me. I love those. <laughs> Knee change. Please ask the cashier. So it says. This is a cool one. Yeah, you just put your money in and twist it. Found a single plastic cup for a dollar with glitter on it. And look at this one. Also a dollar. Hey, this is Fiesta Wear. Well, it says that it is. This is Fiesta Wear for 20. 
These are adorable. Instead of three bowls for 12, I'm going to get... Oh, that's like that other one yeah. that you had. Yeah. I sold it. These are Westinghouse refrigerator dishes. Look at that though, you get all three. This one doesn't have a lid. Well. But compare just those two, that's uh, $6 each. And I would say, do it. So I'm gonna do it. I thought this was neat, but it's too damaged. What's wrong with that? Oh, literally the big damaged chip. Yep. But this is fun. I, I love West, Westinghouse. Just do. Okay, so they don't have carts here. So we just have to throw it as hard as we can <laughs> and hope it hits the register. <laughs> or we have to buy like a basket and that's what we use. Oh, this is the Leaning Tower of Westinghouse. Oh, good. <laughs> Did it. Oh, what is this? It is clothing. I think I had one of them. The little cassette recorder. I was thinking of Aaron's. He's saying, "Was it? I forget the name of that song. It's that time of the year. Oh yeah, it's like a Christmas he has song. Recordings on. Tape it sounds like it's that time of the year. Like that's kind of what it sounds like. He's, he, it's a fun little ditty. It is. It's a fun little ditty we played." Maybe I should find it and play it on the channel sometime. I think, you should. <laughs> I think Aaron would find it kind of funny himself. He probably would. <laughs> you know what, what else Aaron used to do? He used to walk around and interview people during the holidays. Yep. He would say, um, okay, Emmett, uh, what do you think of that meal you just had? Right. <laughs> <laughs> and he'd be like, oh, it was good. Okay. And what about you, uh, Margie? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> It was a whole interview about food. And that makes good sense about if you know anything about Aaron. <laughs> so funny. I just sold a set of these. The ketchup and the mustard. Now these are $18 for the pair. But they've got a lot more crazing on them. So you can see on the lid on that one. But what's great about this set is the spoons in this set are both in perfect shape. So it's the ketchup and the mustard. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Yep. So, they're adorable, huh? Don't you love them little faces? The ketchup and the mustard. Ah. Okay, Barb. So, we've got lots more to see. And hopefully... Ooh, that's a cute bird. $19. Adorable. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So, it is Farberware and it has these Art Deco tulips. Just think about it. Think about springtime, how that happens every year. And then also Art Deco. Good for you, Art Deco. It has the sliced or the pierced metal, the pet metal rim with a basket, a handle, and it's marked on the underside there. Yep. I was gonna say, I'm gonna put it in the cart, but <laughs> there isn't one because they don't have them. So I'll put it in my pocket. There's like this whole booth full of jars. Look at that. That's cute. I don't know what you do with it, though. What would I do with it? Oh, it's like a snake. <laughs> um, $15. Or you could have corks. I feel like you have to earn the corks, though. You gotta drink your own wine. Model paints. So they're, like, themed. This one. Treasure jar of cool, mostly vintage stuff. 15 Pretty cool. This one is a blue, a blue ball jar with the zinc top lid, buttons, spools. There's like old spools too, uh, wood ones. Those are fun. Oh, look at all those army people. That's neat too. Jeez. There's more of them. And they got all these little bags of cars on the ground. Oh, better homes and gardens. That's so cute. 1941. Oh, these old magazines are so fun to look through. Five bucks. It's not bad. No, no, not bad at all. Oh, there's ephemera packs. I love ephemera packs. How much? Ten bucks. See, I would buy them and use them just for 
my package toppers. See that Betty, that Browery Babe? That's part of the um, um, Old Maid deck. The, one of the old, old Maid decks. These are fun. Very, very fun. Five dollars. Adorable. I find these things so fun. This is a fish tank aquarium piece and they have $17 on it. But it's really tropical and cool. So that's neat. Oh, look at this one. The carnival glass. That's pretty. It has like a cobalt base on it. I wonder what pattern that is. Huh. And the price tag is covered. Darn it. Barb, I saw... What was it? Okay, so they're like $10, but I just thought this was a really pretty salt and pepper shaker set. That is pretty. With the butterflies on them. And it's mm -hmm. Occupy Japan, too. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I do, too. I, th I think it could go for $24, $26. It's just a really pretty set. And, of course, Occupy Japan dates from the... Uh, between 1945 and 1952. So I think I'm going to get that girl. Oh, this is $98 for the Roseville. Yeah. Okay, so I need to get into this case. This is number 272. So I was looking at this really cool frame, and it's old. But what I like about this one is its base. It has like a little base on it. Isn't that pretty? You can really see the gilding better. So it's called a tilt frame, by the way. And it's a tabletop frame, and it's $20. And it has this little guy in there, <laughs> a little guy. Um, but I like them, they're so pretty. I just, I just think this one has a lot of great detail on it. I really do. That base is cool. There's this other one here, which is more, uh, it's, it, this is what I'm not used to seeing. And $20 on this one's not bad either. It has the frame, wood, it's old. So I think I'm going to go ahead and get it. I'll at least double my money on that one. So, oh, that's a cool piece of uh, blue Isn't crackle. It? Oh, that one. Wait, no, the, what? Where, the one what? you just touched. Oh, that's yeah. not crackle. Well, from back here, I thought okay, it was. Yeah, yeah I think it's just a pattern. Yeah, it's a pattern. Twenty-seven. I'm getting. I'm attached to this because that's of that pretty. cool design. Very it's twelve dollars. Oh, what, and you and you don't get the saucer. No, you don't. I mean, I have some green stripe saucer probably at home anyway. It's from the 40s, I think. I'd have to do math in my head, but mm -hmm. I think it would clean up. Maybe I will since I haven't got anything here. <laughs> you need get a souvenir. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of bleak over there piled up in the corner. This oh is in... <laughs> this is in this... Uh, oh, look at the... I just noticed the fish with their packages for 25. Fin twins. I like their name. Oh. Um, 25 is on the edge. Actually, it's, I think, over the edge for me for resale, but I was, there's the Balik. There, I got that out of my system. But yeah, there's the white set and then a black set for 25 a, a set. So these are made right out of St. Louis. Oh. See the, the speckle on there? Oh, yeah. That's so pretty. Huh. So I guess, is it? Oh yeah, it's complete. I thought it was missing something, but now you get the three bubbles, the fish and the other fish. Mm -hmm. mm, that's neat. That's really, really tempting. I kind of like this. I don't know how much it is though. <laughs> Look at that. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it reminds me of, well, you know, me on some days or like yeah, that's you? Any, any mother when they sit down sometimes and they're just like, well, <laughs> yeah, it's been a day. <laughs> <laughs> Do you wonder, see, now I'm thinking I should get this these like do you think maybe they would get that these percentage the, that off package is better yeah but you're gonna want them out of the package anyway right oh to put them on a wall um i don't know i like i like the colorful speckles but that has colorful speckles too if i just get both it'll be do it. it'll be solved okay uh -oh. I knew that was gonna happen we'll pick that up i'm gonna do it oh here's the price tag um, One fifty. Oh, okay, that's a good person, I guess. <laughs> You're a good French post-war contemporary painter. She's mad about the war. Hmm. Clearly, that's too bad. I like that. <laughs> All right, yeah, I did. I got the pair of fish wall plaques, and they did um, ten percent off because it was over twenty-five. So that is good. I got a deal. Okay. 
I'll go down that aisle a little for all you guys. Oh, yeah, you actually out. missed um, part of that aisle over there. Yeah. I think she's looking for one more thing. One more. <laughs> she's trying. She's trying desperately. And I will maybe find something else if I look again. <laughs> so I looked at that half, right? Yeah, we Look were, that. you... Wait, no, I didn't see that. Because there's like some bunny. Actually, there. neither did I. Oh, <laughs> this is why <laughs> we have to go in the regular row. Yeah, formation. we were really backwards <laughs> at the start of all this. I was. That's a lot of clocks. I mean, my goodness. Are they old? Look how many they're, like the marble? Telecron? They yeah. They just like to collect. They, they're just gravitate. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they've Weird. got prices on them. Because so. there's so many that are the same. It might have been their own collection, I imagine. All these, like, cathedral-looking clocks. And the ship, there's, like, a ship wheel down here. That's cool. Very nice. Tick-tock. Wow, that was pretty good. So we both got a nice little pile. Well, you got two things. <laughs> hey, I but, got two things. <laughs> hey, boy. <laughs> It could have been one. So I, and I got my box or two. They're little boxes, but uh, we did well. So I will wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.